Are you looking to add a fire button to light burn to focus your diode laser? Well, if you are, you're in the right spot. What am I talking about? Let's jump into this together and I'll explain. So now that we're in the light burn software, one of the first things we're going to do is go over here to the move tab that you can see here. We're going to click on it and you notice there isn't a fire button over here. So to add that fire button, what we're going to do is go up to the top level menu to edit. We're going to click edit. We're going to move down to device settings. We're going to click device settings. We're going to go over here to where you see enable laser fire button. We're going to activate that and we're going to click OK. Now you see there's no fire button here yet. One of the things we're going to have to do is go up here and restart the light burn software. So let's go ahead and do that. Okay, we've restarted light burn and here we go. We have the fire button. Now for me as a percentage of power, now you want to be careful with this too. I usually set it to about 0.5%. What this does is gives me a rather dim bar and it makes it easier for at least in my opinion for me to focus it to a tight beam. So this works out well for me. So hopefully it'll work out for you guys. I know I get a lot of questions about this so hopefully I've answered it with this so if this was helpful give it a big thumbs up don't forget to subscribe to the channel a lot more of this coming and also swag shop up in the corner cheers catch you later please click like below and subscribe to the channel to keep up to date on all of our projects